So how is the Missouri General Assembly session going so far? If you ask anybody in Jefferson City, the answer among most people is not that great. I am not the first senator willing to stand up for my principles, and I'll stand here till Christmas if I have to. The first month of the General Assembly session has been personified by a high-octane conflict between Senate Republican leadership and a renegade faction known as the Missouri Freedom Caucus. And while the specific conflict seems to change day by day, at the center of it all is a belief from conservative lawmakers that Senate leaders are not prioritizing the party's key issues. I mean, they're like the, the schoolyard bully that wants to come up, punch you in the face, and then, and then cry victim because you punched them back. But Democrats who have been following this conflict closely believe what's happening in 2024 is indicative of larger trends within the National Republican Party. Everybody texting me about how insane this is and look at this and look at that. And in the meantime, a single mom's trying to make ends meet. And, and you know, it's just, it's sad. It's sad to watch it. It's sad to watch the Senate die. So how will this Senate skirmish affect the already low expectations for the 2024 legislative session in Missouri? Read our coverage of the Missouri General Assembly on stlpr.org.